Segovia. An historic town of 55,000 with a rich history and a famous Roman aqueduct is well worth a short visit. Nearly 2,000 years ago, Segovia was a Roman military base in need of water. So Emperor Trajan's engineers rerouted a stream into town by building this nine-mile-long aqueduct. This massive structure, ingeniously constructed with no mortar, provided water to Segovia until modern times. While locals claim it could still work today, its primary function seems to be providing a backdrop for family fun. Segovia's main pedestrian drag is clogged with people enjoying a festive spring day out. While Romanesque churches and statues honoring 16th century local heroes are ignored, kids get plenty of attention. The Plaza Mayor marks Segovia's Old Town Center. It's early in the afternoon on a Saturday. And as on plazas all over Spain, people are out with family and friends. It's prime time to enjoy an aperitivo before heading home for the main meal of the day, a late lunch. Segovia's Plaza Mayor wasn't always so idyllic. It was long the scene of bullfights. Imagine spectators jamming these balconies, screaming, Toro, Toro, Ole! In the 19th century, bullfights on this square were stopped. When the residents complained, town fathers gave them a more genteel form of entertainment, this bandstand. The town's cathedral stands high above its main square. Embellished to the hilt with pinnacles and flying buttresses, it's a good example of that final overripe stage of Gothic called flamboyant. Segovia's Alcazar, or fortress, still seems to defend the far end of town. Once the king's summer retreat and palace, it burned down and was rebuilt. Like so many castle rebuilds in the romantic 19th century, it's a fanciful exaggeration barely resembling the original. 